much, Carla. Hey, Dancing with the Stars is off to a great start. Last night, the first person was eliminated, and Frank Marino, star of Divas Las Vegas at the Link, joins us with a breakdown. Mm, Welcome. Yes. I missed you last week, I so know. there's a lot going on that there we got to catch up on. And I'm kind of bummed at the uh, person eliminated because uh, she's part of a very popular ABC show yes. called Shark Tank. And I <laughs> love that show myself. Yeah. It's an amazing show. And uh, Barbara, Barbara Corkin is the one who should have went home. That's the only thing. You know, she gave it her best. She was doing this Ms. Robinson thing with her dance <laughs> partner, just flirting like crazy with him. It was kind of funny. But um, out of all the dances, and it is a dance contest, she was the worst. But I just love her watching her on TV, so I did yeah. feel really bad. But hey, how many people that age could say they were on Dancing with the Stars? Exactly. And it's funny, we're good at some things, we're not the best exactly. at others. And it really exactly. shows that uh, exactly. she's great on Shark Tank. Okay, so uh, let's talk about Drew Scott. Uh, okay. Lives in Las Vegas, right? Yes, One of yes, our faves. and I'm friends with his brother, yep. JD. And last week I That's told him, you know, we'll be talking. Isn't yeah. he great? And um, I think the judges, I said this last week, are really being mean to him. They called him like goofy and lanky yesterday. <laughs> and. You know he is, but he I, I've seen other people start out <laughs> a lot worse than he has, and I just think they're being really tough on him. And he's probably one of the biggest stars there this season yeah. that's actually relevant today. So right. I think he's going to get better because he's just, you know, that type of person that wants to improve everything. Yeah, he's kind of hopping around, but it's kind of fun to watch. Yeah, I like and, it. I, and you know, and, and, and if he's anything as nice as his brother, he's probably really a great guy. Yeah. All right, Debbie Gibson, how did she do? Oh You'd think gosh. that she would just be great right yes. off the bat. Well, I think she was great. I think she was really good. Uh, she's not getting very high scores mm -hmm. but people think because you're a singer you're a performer that's right. not always the truth nope yes and she's got is it Lyme disease that she has she has something yeah. that's very debilitating towards her uh, but she says I'm not gonna use that as an excuse and she wants to show people that even if you have something like that you can still get up and live your life and I think that's a great message all right Lindsay Sterling now she was one of your favorites last week right oh my goodness yes and I absolutely how did she loved do her this week in your eyes well actually uh, everybody loved her outfit yeah it was beautiful <laughs> to start but she's very good but they were a little tougher on her this week as well. I thought she did wonderful, and I think she's going to be one of the top three. You know, I always give mm -hmm. you my thing. I think she'll be definitely one of the top three. And she's a violinist, right? Yes. Am I right? Remembering correctly? Right. Yeah. So who would who would who would have thunk? Okay. Yeah, yeah. I know. Fantastic. Right. I have been a fan of Nick Lachey for a very very long time, mm -hmm. and I was excited that he was taking part in Dancing with the Stars. But I watched the clip and I thought a little, a little stiff. stiff. Now <laughs> you know. Imagine the the pressure right. when your brother was on the show and won. And won. Okay. And your wife is on the show with you. Mm -hmm. So that's kind of like yeah, really hard. Stressful. But you're right. He's kind of stiff. And <laughs> like you said, he's just because he was a singer doesn't mean he <laughs> knew how to dance. Well, he wasn't a boy band. You think he had some moves, but it, I guess it, not the flowy dance. And that's the dance. thing. People can move, but can you dance? <laughs> right. You know? True. Uh-oh. Look at him. So he's there so you skip. go. All right, but Vanessa did great, right? So now his wife. Now this is the worst thing. Mm -hmm. She's in the top every week. Uh -huh. She's going to be the second person I vote for in the top at the end. She's amazing. She's so gorgeous, she, too. She, she has to go home with him, and then how does that car ride? You know, how's that car ride go? Right. You know, yeah. Uh, because she's getting the top of the scores, and he's getting pretty much towards the bottom. So mm -hmm. I could imagine that household. That's interesting. I know things. I'd like to be a fly not, on the wall. Uh, that's yeah. very true. But she's very, very <laughs> gracious about it, and that's what's very nice. And she's always complimenting her husband, mm -hmm. and I think that's really great. All right, so we have a minute. So tomorrow, just real quick, you're going to come back on because there's another tomorrow. Elimination there'll be tonight. another elimination. Yes, because they don't like to have anybody go the first week. So okay. tomorrow will be another elimination. We'll talk about that. Okay. But you've got a big announcement real yeah, quick, Yeah, so while right? people are going away, this is this September is now, this month, 32 years performing straight 30, through on the Las Vegas trip. Unbelievable, Isn't Frank. The longest, I right? I know. And longest I'm only 28 money. years old, so I don't know how that <laughs> figured in. <laughs> but the better news over the 32 years is I just signed five more years oh, to good. keep me as a... Uh, the queen of the strip. Wow, congratulations. For at least another, yeah. So Longest we definitely running have 37 years. We know we're getting to 37, We, we know right? we, if, as long as I survive it, we <laughs> could get 37 for sure. I know you'll survive it. It'll be just as fabulous. You know what? Your show's great. People love it because it's, uh, when you're in Las Vegas, you want to see something different and you want to yes. have some fun. And that's what it is with Divas. It's all these different stars in one show. So you yeah. can see Cher, Britney, J-Lo, mm -hmm. all the people you see for hundreds and hundreds of dollars in one shot for a lot less. Love it. We'll see you tomorrow at 11.15, Looking Frank. Forward. And congratulations. Thank you. Stay with us.